My name is Nikolai Zhilagin. I'm a CEO of the Tsar Piva Draft Beer Store chain. I love beer very much, and for long enough I couldn't find a store where I could buy good, high-quality, fresh beer. Really, I've tried many places, point of sales, and as a result I had to buy bottled beer in store chains nearby, because I wasn't satisfied with the quality of what I was drinking. So the idea to make a good, nice-looking beer store came to my mind. First, it was just one store. It was, so to say, the idea in the row, trying out the concept. The point of the idea was to offer people a wide range by reasonable price. I think there is no sense to overprice this product, only because it is dispensed from the tap instead of being sold in a bottle. For that moment, no one could offer a decent range. The maximum amount of taps in a store was, well, maybe 20. The first store I opened had 50, honest 50 taps, honest 50 swords, that already for that moment were delivered directly from the breweries, including Siberian. And my hope was that sales volume, as well as a number of customers, would make it profitable. It was about selling a lot and make it cheap. Additionally, providing the quality of a product and a wide range. Beer is close to me. I like beer very much. Without exaggeration, I'm an expert in this area, both in practical and theoretical meanings. I know perfectly what to do with this product to meet the needs of the customers. I have many friends who have similar business, that is draft beer to go, and very often they call me beer maniac or crazy. Because in their opinions, I do a lot of things that could be avoided or I could save on. However, from my point of view, these things are necessary to bring high-quality products to every customer. Yes, it is complicated, yes, it is expensive, and yes, it is hard. But nevertheless, if something can be done to improve the quality, we definitely do this. Indeed, several key features considering only final points store, although, of course, it's not right. We should consider all the chain, from the brewery to the final customer, from the bottle to the mug of every person. However, even in the store, you can notice, first of all, a range of 60 beer tanks. This is 60 honest swords. Not just 60 swords, but 60 swords from more than 20 breweries. Adding to these 60 swords, 600 swords in a bottle, it turns out to be a really unique store. I'm not sure if there is such like store in Russia. You should have a lot of things of all kinds, which are quite inexpensive. First of all, circulating packing. It is really significant investment. These are barrels and kegs. You should have a lot of them, and it is expensive, say in the list of it. This is a logistics, our own cars, hired cars, dispatchers, and so on and so forth. There are loaders. This is a whole staff of people who keep track of orders. There was a simple way to deal with wholesalers, who are in abundance today and offer a very wide range of beer brands. However, I'm not sure in ways and methods of wholesalers work. To be precise, I know for sure how do they work. And what doesn't suit me is first of all the way they work, the quality of the work. As for the price, often it is more profitable to buy from them. Any consumer sees only the final goal, only the product he is drinking. However, it is really important to know how one product differs from another. Why the beer can sometimes be sore and why the beer can sometimes be bad quality. How many times the beer system was washed, how many times it was changed in the store. Nobody knows the storage temperature, neither in the store nor on the way to the store. Why one can come and be sure in the quality of the product here. Today, in our store, you can see up to 70 sorts of dropped beer, almost half of which are the most topical novelties in craft brewing. There are more than 60 sorts of bottled beer from all over the world on the shelves. But the range is not the most important. 
what is the most important, that is quality. I have been working as a seller for long enough in my store and many people asked interesting and provocative questions. So maybe all the beer is from one barrel? Hardly you really have there a cooling room. And I took some people's hands, took them to the storeroom and showed a cooling room the amount of barrels. And then all the questions were dropped. Unfortunately, it is not possible to take everyone to the storeroom. And that is why I have planned to make this video, to show people how in fact the storage and the delivery of the beer happens in my company. In course of time, people's tastes change towards better quality of products, I would say world class. Without exaggeration, today there is a large number of breweries that brew beer not worse than in Belgium, Germany, Czech Republic and the US. And exactly towards these sorts move customers' tastes. During this, I can say, for many years, in fact, I've been trying to meet not only consumers' demand, but in some way make them moving towards more quality and interesting products.